Hi, I'm Scott Corrigan. Been going to Burke Community Church since 2011. We moved up to the area, uh, did a little church surfing, and uh, we came to Burke Community Church. So quickly we started coming on Sundays. Uh, we didn't commit to membership or anything for a while, but that's, that's really all that I did. I found that my life was, was pretty busy and uh, I wasn't willing to commit to serving or anything like that. As a matter of fact, I came and I watched week after week Pastor Marty speak and then I would make literally a beeline to the door. I wouldn't make any eye contact with any other guys. I wouldn't grip and grin or give anybody handshakes for fear that they might ask me to do something. And this went on for several years. And I found that part of that was uh, you know, possibly some of my hidden sin and shame in the past is what kept me from wanting to get more involved in the church and to be transparent around other men. And finally, uh, I complained to my wife that I didn't have any friends at this church and maybe this wasn't the place for us and that maybe we should find another church. And um, I look back on that and I, I, I'm so glad that we stuck it out because somebody finally invited me to a Bible study, one of the brothers did, and, and I went and I started quickly realizing uh, the worth of fellowship with other men and sharing with other men and just not being so isolated. Uh, it has really grown from there because then I said, ah, I used to make coffee in the Navy. Let me uh, get on the coffee team. And where else can I serve? And maybe I can help out at base camp. And um, then somebody invited me to the retreat, and I kind of was like, oh, a whole weekend. And then Richard Dick, one of the brothers that goes here, he, uh, he said, I'll drive you. I'll come pick you up at your house. And he made it so easy for me, that first retreat I went to. I just couldn't say no. So I'm so glad that I went. Uh, as I look back and I see the way it is now, it's like when I come into Burke Community Church, it's home. Uh, I see guys and it's like the, the show Cheers. You wanna go where everybody knows your name. And you get to see guys and you get to give them a hug or just a good handshake and say hello and smile. And it's completely different than my experience the first couple of years. But I realized it was, my, it, was, it was me. It was me not willing to come out of my safe zone. All of this was a, a series of God maturing me and working in my life. I'm so glad that uh, I just chose Him. And that's what Christ can do in your life when you make Him at the center of your heart. So I'm so glad that I did it. And uh, I feel so blessed to be part of this church.